should I scan a petalar tendon? This question came from Gunther. Mark, do you want to say something here? Or should I play the video? No, no. so uh, yeah, Gunther uh, asked this question. And um, so uh, I prepared the question. And uh, what we did actually is that we placed on the um, one to treat sonography platform uh, 17 hours of uh, content, uh, 22 chapters with a total, uh, I think, like 150 videos. Um, and what we did in the MSK bachelor class is we um, um, uh, paid attention to not only anatomy and sonoanatomy, but also to how to scan certain structures and also, uh, if we scan it, how does it look like in pathology? So uh, th these are roughly the chapters we uh, we offer, and this we had uh, we created for the shoulder, the elbow, the wrist, the hip, the knee, and the ankle. And Gunther's question is actually um, about scanning the patella tendon. And um, yeah, so uh, I prepared a clip for that, and this is also a clip which is part of the, the MSK Bachelor class, which uh, is on. Uh, one to three sonography. The fourth transducer position of the knee protocol is scanning the infrapatellar region. And uh, we're going to do this longitudinally. And the patient is uh, in supine, bolster underneath the knee so that we have this 30 degree of flexion to, uh, to tighten and stretch in the uh, patella tendon. Uh, but later we're also going to make a uh, flexion to 45 to 90 degrees. But first in this 30 degrees, we're going to place the transducer uh, on the patella. So what we see is uh, the patella bone, hyperechoic with uh, behind, we can see the acoustic shade. And these are the first fibers of the patella tendon, the patella ligament, uh, going all the way horizontal to the tibia and inserting at the tibial tuberosity. So this is the insertion at the tibial tuberosity. You can see that the patellar tendon has beautiful fibers horizontally in screen. They are perpendicular being scanned, so there is no anisotropy. Underneath the um, uh, yeah, so yeah, so that, that was a little bit of a highlight how to uh, scan the the patellar tendon.